Understanding the major third in music. Hello everyone, and welcome to our latest video. Today, we're diving into the world of music theory to explore a fascinating concept, the major third. This term might sound technical, but don't worry, we'll break it down together in a simple and engaging way. So, whether you're a music enthusiast, a language learner, or just curious, stay tuned. A major third is a type of musical interval. In music, an interval refers to the distance between two notes. To understand a major third, think of a scale, do, re, m, i, f, a, so, la, t, do. In this scale, if you start at one note and count up to the third note, you found a major third. For example, from C to E is a major third. It's known for its consonant and pleasant sound in music. Let's take a closer look with some examples. Many popular songs and melodies use the major third. A classic example is the first two notes of the song, Kumbaya. You can also hear it in the Happy Birthday song, specifically between the first two notes of Happy Birthday. These familiar tunes illustrate how the major third creates a harmonious and uplifting sound. Interestingly, the major third isn't just a Western music concept. It appears in various musical traditions around the world, often playing a key role in the melodic structure of songs and compositions. This universality makes the major third a great example of how music can transcend cultural barriers. Recognizing a major third by ear can be fun and rewarding. A good way to practice is by listening to different songs and identifying the intervals. You can also use a piano or a keyboard app to play two notes and hear if they form a major third. This exercise will enhance your musical ear and deepen your appreciation for music. We hope this video has illuminated the concept of the major third for you. It's a small part of music theory, but understanding it can open doors to a richer musical experience. Keep exploring and enjoying music, and as always, thank you for watching. Remember, every note counts in the symphony of learning. See you in our next video.